Mina like Chapa, Vile Wow like Chapa, Mina Sipele Kabang, Mina Sipele Kabang. So my question is, why would you ban border borders within the CBD? What's why? Is it because they are dirty and they are trying to make this place a looting space? What is the reason that the county is giving? As far as I know, in every sector, there are normally good people and bad people. Okay. The people have taken advantage of the border borders mm -hmm. to loot. Okay. Even mark people. I've seen videos yes. of guys uh, using border borders to, to maybe carjack or to rob yes. with, with guns yes. in town. Videos from Nairobi. What do you have to say to that? Uh, I can't uh, know for sure if that's mm -hmm. true. Mm -hmm. But, but uh, you've seen those videos. I've right? seen those videos. How but does it make you feel? Because it's it maybe feel bad. It's your colleague. Because it you know, destroys the image. Mm. People, when someone sees a border border, he sees him as a bad person, as yeah. an evil person. Yeah. And uh, in most cases, you might find out most of these guys are not even operators within the CBD. Mm -hmm. The people who are coming from outside the CBD mm -hmm. with the, the sole intention to rob mad people. Okay. Yes. And this is so interesting, man. Like, how, how do you determine who a good border border rider is and who's a bad guy? How do you differentiate? For us in CBD, we know each other. Okay. We know each other. Mm. So uh, maybe my advice is that the county government, like uh, uh, I read in the news a while back, that they have formed a, a special squad mm -hmm. to deal with mugging. Eh? Mm -hmm. So my advice was that the honorable government even to form a special team mm -hmm. of people to work on the regulation of the border borders. Mm. For that, so you're able, you guys are open for regulation. We are open for regulation. But not burning. But not burning. Okay. Yes. So, because the whole idea is to create jobs. Yeah. Because right. in the CBD, roughly, we have over, over 500 motorbikes in town. Mm. That's a rough estimate. And, and this thing has been ongoing. I, I, I remember even the previous county government, Kidero's government, had tried to do something of this sort. Yes. Say that they're not allowed to enter within this space. But honestly speaking, like as a Kenyan, I need somebody to distribute or deliver my packages, yes, yes. to pick my checks back, my checks, mm -hmm. maybe to carry me. Sazilian mm -hmm. uh, Germany, Noma, Nachagari, Pali, and Kimbia I've done that even for, for, for a paper. I was in traffic, mm -hmm. so I just left my car somewhere. Nika mm -hmm. and Ludi can fix up for an exam. Others in the late. Even our honorable MPs do that. Yes. When they're rushing somewhere and they duck in for a motorbike, yeah. they rush to everywhere. And there's uh, somebody else who's uh, agreeing with you is a lady called Atena. Jumbe saying, let not a few border border riders make the rest suffer. She's listening from KIMC yes. South B. Yes, yes. And we have a clip from one of your colleagues. Let's listen to this.